Now, why is it I got a congregation of folks here from all over the country, and some of them have a high school education, and they know more about human nature than Schuler out in California? Isn't that a strange thing? You must have been spending some time with the Spirit instead of the flesh. Oh, that's a fleshy thing. And now the next thing, look at verse 8, again the same verse. The flesh attacks first. Did you notice that? They didn't attack Amalek. Amalek attacked them. Why people get on rocking. He's always attacking, always negative, always down and forth. He thinks he's right and everybody else is wrong. What's, the, uh, what's this business of attacking the brethren? Why, these fundamentalists, all they do is kill their own wounded, you know. Blah, blah. Listen, did you know a lot of times troops kill their own wounded? Did you know sometimes your wounded want to be killed? Why, these, these, these inexperienced nuts writing these books like that, they don't know anything about what, wounded or shooting or combat or anything else. There's been many a fellow begging somebody to kill him who was wounded. I don't, you take, I don't, I don't kill the wounded. The ones I attack, they're not helpless wounded people that have fallen in combat and need to be restored. I don't go around and kill any helpless wounded people. But I don't attack a man, they attack that book. Amen. You can look through my stuff, it's 120 different books I've written here in the last 40 years, and you can't find three pages in there attacking a Christian man anywhere in this country for his personal life. Because Every Achilles has a heel, and every armor's got a chink in it, and all of sin that comes short of the glory of God, and I can't waste my time digging in the dirt. But if they attack that book, you'll find their name there, boy. And Why is that? They attack first. I didn't attack. I didn't attack. I didn't pick on them. I never picked on a man that didn't pick on that Bible first. But you pick on that Bible, I'll pick on you. Folks say, well, who do you think you are? I think I'm a sinner saved by grace. And God all gave me a book that's the kiss of God on my walk. And I'll tell you what that book has done for me. You go mess with that book, I'm going to mess with you. And the fellow who taught you and the fellow who taught him. And as far as I'm, I'll get back to this in a minute. But as far as I'm concerned, this room tonight was filled with the graduates of Bob Jones and Tennessee Temple and Baptist Bible and Moody and Fuller and Wheaton and... Uh, Northwest and Southwest and uh, Louisville Theological Seminary, Denver Theological Seminary, Pacific Coast Bible College, Dallas Theological Seminary, and Mercer and Judson Stetson. They couldn't keep me awake. Hey! 